Well, today we're in Tulsa, and here we're coming into the House of Guitars, and I uh, really don't know what to expect here. I do know that their thing is vintage instruments. Wow, look at these oldies. <laughs> I just got to take a look around here first. Oh, they have Ferks here, look. I wonder if he's got a Ferk baritone. I've got to check that out. Wow, oh, Kalamazoo, look at that. There's an old Larrabee. Oh my goodness. What a neat store. Delaney. Wow. 1983 Wait. ovation. Look at that. It's beautiful. Beautiful 19, ovation. It says 83? Yeah, it's an 83 ovation. Yeah. Oh, look, you gotta get up here. There's your guitar There's case. There's my guitar case. <laughs> That's a poor person who's been places. Oh no, that's a card down there. I don't know what this is. It's $4,999. Yeah, but look at the inlay on that thing. It's yeah. beautiful. And this looks like an old one. See, I can't see that with this glare. Is that an old Martin or no? It's not. Your back. I'm worried about your back. What's that say? I think I don't know. Wait, let me just zoom in. Look at this old advertising for Fender Strings. <laughs> Fender Strings and Things. Oh, so it's just a little travel guitar. Huh? So, all you do is lift this up right here, and this lets this neck go, and it comes off. Okay, I'll just show you. It comes off completely. Oh, There, I gotta get this. This is the hardest part. You're a brave man. Well, it's just, <laughs> it looks scary. This is how it works. It's kind of dumb. It, is this like walnut or something, you know? Or? It is. Yeah, okay, that's right. Okay. There you go. So this just comes off. So, wow. <laughs> and then. That is so neat. So here. Oh, oh my, my goodness. goodness. That comes off. <laughs> oh my goodness. It does amazing. come off. This. Oh, and it just has a little pocket for it. Oh, oh my goodness. And then, goodness. I'll show you. They thought of everything. You can see. Oh. Can we hold that? Yeah. So I can show you. There. It all There's this like little PVC little coping in there that grabs it. Oh, that is so cool. That just lives in there. And then you just take all of this. And it just all fits into this like literal little backpack down that here. Oh my word. Let me see the airplane. So, let me make sure I have this twist. So now you gotta get it back together. Okay, hold that for one second, just okay. like that. <laughs> and it will be out of tune when you put it in. What's, that's the thing, we'll see. It's normally not, it's honestly normally not far enough. That's sweet. Sure Here, put there. this down and play it. Okay. <laughs>
sound for such a little thing. This thing runs uh, fourteen hundred dollars. <laughs> the whole thing taking it apart. I mean, I've never seen a travel guitar go into so many pieces. <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, oh, it comes, I see, the neck. It There's comes three, and it, it tucks comes, in here. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's really interesting. Jane. I'm pretty sure that's because I remember <laughs> seeing some. And this is LJ Anna. I think that's what this is. Martin? No. Oh, this is Santa Cruz. Oh, Santa Let's check this out. Like, this is 5,000. That's a Tim guitar. Legends were made in British Columbia, the world's finest handmade guitars, the Legend Company. It does Can have a see, see the Pyramid Bridge. And what is that? Let me see what it says on here. It's a $3,000 legend. How's, that's it. It doesn't have a date. I wish it did.
Sears and Roebuck. Do you, oh, you work here? No. So we're just no. imposing. No, no, no. We're not putting you to work. That's how it is. I'm sorry. I used to. I apologize. That's what happens. You go to Walmart, right? They put you to work. Yeah. Hey, young man, help me yeah. get this stuff. I know. <laughs> we get a little bossy as we get that's older. I understand. I turned 50 last year. Oh, that's I'm... your baby. <laughs> this is really neat. <laughs> I can't get over that. That is amazing. This is an old K. It is as heavy as heavy can get. <laughs> this thing feels to be about seven pounds, maybe eight. Yeah, it's really heavy. It's a jumbo. It, that's an old no, guitar. Oh my goodness, it's old. It looks like they had a neck reset, which rightfully so after all these years. I'm sure this is probably 60s or 50s. Look at the inlay on that. It looks like it's got an ebony fingerboard. This is probably the top of the line. Okay. things just live on like this. Yeah, did you see to... this one you, that was sitting next to you? It's oh, almost 100 years old. That's oh, that one right there? Yeah, oh, oh, my oh, oh my goodness. Oh my word, it's some beautiful shape. Oh, oh, it's gorgeous. Let's we'll check that out. Uh -huh. They got it priced right. <laughs> yeah, I see that. <laughs> you know, $100 it's... for every year. <laughs> yeah, you know it's something special. Uh -huh. Oh my goodness. Oh, I just love this. This thing is so heavy though, it's like it's like a tank. Mm -hmm. That's what we had to learn on tanks. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, that, that makes it easier to play though. Oh yeah. The good ones. Yeah, the yeah. Ones. yeah now uh, it's like, well, this is nothing. <laughs> I learned on a classical. Oh, you learned. And then when you go to an acoustic, yeah. it's just like, oh, yeah, this is so much easier. <laughs> you don't have near the distance yeah, between the Yeah, figuring out to here, especially the old Max. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this was a little an old, over two yeah, inches yeah, there. Really like Big old fat <laughs> neck. <laughs> They got an old Gibson arch top here. And uh, they want $1,700 for this one. It says it's a banner repaired. Wow. So there's the banner. Yeah. And uh, these were made by women. That's the one you've been looking yeah, for. Yeah, I have the book that was just recently Only a Gibson John. is good enough. He signed it for me. So yeah, this is really cool. So this is a banner guitar. You've been looking for a banner. Uh, more, uh, not so much an arch top, but, oh. a, but an acoustic. But this is... So during the war, the women had to step up and play this way. Pick guard though. 
old, old Gibson. Hear it? It's mm -hmm. really loud. It's a... It's got a lot of sound. It just needs to be set up right. That's all. And, you know, there's a lot of adjustments you can do with this bridge. It's just not set up right. But it, it certainly takes you back, and I love to see that banner. I love the banner. Yeah. It's in the 40s. Yep. It's amazing. So this is a Martin. This is not vintage. And did this beauty catch your eyes and ears? You can scan it for information. This one here is uh, $2,700. It's a zero size, as you can see, it's small. That means this is anywhere between, probably about 13 inches right there. And uh, let's see. setup but I think sometimes they leave the setup so that you can personalize it but this is a very very nice guitar has a beautiful neck the neck has a low profile nice and slim um, and uh, let me just say that one more time this is a 018 so it has mahogany back beautiful so I don't know the whole story behind the Kalamazoo, but this is definitely old. for $29. <laughs> <Maybe less. laughs> but yeah, there it is. And there's that tortoiseshell binding again. Oh, that pick guard, I don't know if that's original or not. But it looks like they fixed a few cracks and it's been through a little bit of wear in this day. But it's still playable. It started out at $29. And, and like always, the action is off the <laughs> off the charts. <laughs> It started at $29 and it's up to $1,899. <laughs> That's inflation for you. That shows you. <laughs> Let's see if it was made. A Larrabee? Larrabee. I think this is a Canadian one. Yeah. See, the earlier Larrabees were made in Canada and now they're made in the United States. Let me see. Get close to the.
But after playing the acting guitar. <laughs> okay. This is a furk. And um, I think that's mahogany. And yeah, let's see what it says here. This is their blue line, and it's an OM. like a cedar top. That's why it makes me wonder what that, I don't know what that back is. I'm pretty sure it's, it's so light in color. That's why I'm thinking it has the grain of like a, a mahogany, but it doesn't look like it in color. But yeah, this, these are really nice. This is a fur blue line. And uh, that's, oh, it tells you right here. That's right. It's a CM, cedar and mahogany. Okay, we got it, we were right. And this is the orchestra model. Very, very nice. I'm still impressed with the little travel. Eight again. Uh, now another fur guitar. Ooh, that's gorgeous. This looks like it has rosewood. Oh. This is Beautiful. very, very pretty. That finish is gorgeous. Gorgeous. Wow. What is the price on that? Well, this one is uh, $2,800. That's, I mean, you can't beat this price. Let's see if it plays $2,800. I like this brand, Burke. Beats out all that you've it, seen it so far. It, this is this is amazing. You, you gotta be here. It, the thing just resonates. You just feel it just vibrating against you. It is amazing.
get it. <laughs> that is that is just outstanding. Look at those beautiful pins. They kind of look like bone or something, some kind of an elk bone or something. They're beautiful. It's a uh, the binding. It looks to be like a uh, maybe a black wood of some sort. I don't know. Maybe not. No, nope, it's some kind of fox. Um, because I see the sparkle in it, like a tortoise shell. This oh. is gorgeous, man. Is that green love? <laughs> oh, no, that... this is a fur. Oh, yeah, this is amazing. Oh, you're, you're not a salesperson. No, 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 I thought he was. Well, no, no, no. I'll put you to work if you're in here. You say, I'll go get that. <laughs> I know the shell I'm This is beautiful. Yeah, well, I've been around for a while. That is so neat.